Hello, everybody. Welcome back to the episode of Fallout 76. Today we return, boys and girls, ladies and gentlemen, guys. I have to your favorite fantastic day of the most amazing variety. Today we are making some very awesome progress in the main quest storyline. There actually appears to be a scorched over here. Hello, scorched. I got a little pipe that does a ton of damage to you. Yeah, we got a legendary pipe that does 30% extra damage to schmucks like this dude. Anyways, what we are looking for is the doorway into this building. We got some samples we got a fuse and we're trying to get to the very bottom of this disease that has caused the scorched to unearth themselves and infest this land along with that i'm thinking today we might do a little bit of base building as well since we don't really have a base to call our own we built up a settlement for a little while which was cool and oh my god there's so many of you we gotta get to schmacking boys a schmack and dag dag oh my god how did i miss all of these shots oh he has shotguns and stuff too i don't have a lot of carry weight to pick that stuff up but I really want to pick it up. As you can see, we are at a big crossroads. Maybe there's going to be like a workbench here or something we could use. Whoop, 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 whoop. Jesus, how many people are over there? Okay, I'm going to wait for them to come here. I'm being my pipe, man. Listen, I'm going to lay some pipe. Let's just leave it at that. So if y'all want to get over here, I got some pipe to lay. I just don't want to go out in the open because there we go. Hello, my precious. <laughs> Dude, nothing like one hitting some of these dudes with a lead pipe. Like, ain't nothing better than that. These guys, unfortunately, we don't want to hit quite yet, but uh, we should be able to soon. Oh, my God. He, like, got right past me. But uh, we got to go ahead and level up our strength to do that so our melee weapon is a little bit stronger. Oh, my God. There's so many of them. All right. Why don't we go? Let's whip out a little bit of that 10 millimeter pistol. We haven't had enough chance to shoot some dudes. How did I miss so many, dude? I had, like, a 75% chance of hitting on, like, all of those shots. This is a sham. A sham, I say. Come on, Scorch. Let's get some big old hits on you. Oh, my God. Hulk smash over there. This dude's running through freaking, like, carts and everything. He wants me dead, but uh, guess what? I don't want me dead, so I ain't dying. Oh, my God. Blew that dude's face off. What? How did you get behind me? I definitely just got shot from behind. I'm so confused. Hello? It's a ticket. Ah! Red roach. Get out of here, red roach. Oh, my God. I think that's, like, one of the first red roaches I've met all day. All game. I, I have not met a lot of red roaches. I've been attacked by ticks more. I have valuable blood, apparently. Oh, my God. You people are up on the second floor, too. Take a chill pill. Let me be. I just want to kill you. Grab your loot. If it's good. Oh, my God. Someone's like kamikaze yelling at me. Are they running up on me? Oh, there we go. I knew someone was about to run up on us. Come on. Let's wait. Let's get some big old hiss on you. Come on. Come on. Come on. I think I may have crippled his body or something. Where did you come from? Okay. Back to the pipe. Listen. Pipe. Ah, uh, I think we've learned today that laying pipe is always the solution to any problem. So let's get to laying, boys. Boop. See you to your face. Your face met my pipe. And, well, it's quite obvious how that turned out. Yeah, though, hopefully there's a workbench here or something so I can scrap some of these guns I got. I got, like, a ton of extra shotguns I want to scrap. I got a ton of extra everything. And uh, this guy has some good stuff, but I'd rather scrap them. We don't really sell them for that many caps, unfortunately. And I am a broke boy, so I could go with that. But is that more people I hear? Hello? Schmello? I definitely hear more people. They're probably going to be, like, up in this room or something. Uh, but, I mean, we have power armor. Being overweight isn't the worst thing in the world, at least immediately, but I really hope we could find that workbench. Let's go ahead. Let's install the fuse, and let's do some experimentation over here. Let's load up the blood samples, and uh, I'm guessing we need to activate the lab tests and see where this takes us. Let's analyze the samples or the blood. Let's uh, back it up over there. Let's see what happens. Is it going to, like, blow up in my face? Wouldn't surprise me at this rate. Uh, use the symptomatic to administer the vaccine. Where does symptomatic? This thing over here. Uh, sure thing. God dang it. Gotta take out the power armor. It's all a sham, I'm telling you. They know. They know that I want to take this. Oh, it's kind of plopped on out. They know I'm too powerful in the armor. I'm about to get jumped inside this thing, but, uh... If I'm not mistaken, I believe we may or may not. Oh, getting stabbed in the freaking face, but I think we're cured. That is right. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, you're looking at the recently most vaccinized scorched person. This lady's talking. I'll shut up. That just sounds dope. Ooh. 
Did somebody say weapons? I like weapons. Oh, 50 caliber ball? Wait, a ball can be 50 caliber? What, in tarnation? That's some random stuff. Okay, back to the power armor. Let's re There's got to be a workbench somewhere in here, right? Like, I, I'm not sure you guys understand. I'm about, like, 50 pounds overweight at the moment. I'm Listen, I'm on Weight Watchers. Cut me some slack. But we do need to find something because I have a hoarding problem. And I hoard more than I put stuff away. So, there's got to be... I, I have hope. I have hope. We'll look around... And we'll try to find something, because if you look in the lower right-hand corner, you can see that, uh, well, we're just kind of... Our, our AP is going very, very low. I wish I had, like, the ability to fast travel with, uh, whatchamacall... Ooh, piece of candy. What is this over here? Some kind of locked door. Can I open this? Because there... Looks like there might be fancy stuff in there. <gasps> a terminal? Oh, I'm not even a good enough hacker to hack into that bad boy. Bummer. All right. Why am I getting radiation? I was hearing a couple of those tick, 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 ticks. Mm. Honestly, I feel, you know what the game plan might be? I might, let's just go and build a base right now. We could store some stuff. Whoop, 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 whoop. Hello? Guten Tag, meint comrades. Okay, I'm gonna leave out of here. Yeah, I say, let's just build a base over here in the wonderful county of Charleston. It's a pretty nice area to live, if I do say so myself. And then we'll make our way over to the fire breathers and see what those guys have in store for us. Uh, at some point, another thing that I really want to do, there is a military camp filled with robots. We can go there and we can actually, believe it or not, I'm pretty sure we joined the military. We might need to do that side quest to be able to uh, access. We found a nuclear silo just the other episode. So yeah, if you guys aren't already, there's actually a playlist link in the description down below. There should be some pop-ups, some annotations popping up. Feel free to catch up with the rest of the series if you haven't already. We're making some dope progress over here. Make sure you are subscribed with the notification bell. Hit to stay up to date with it as we continue. And of course, if you're enjoying it, let me know with that like button. Shameless plug. Oh, la gasp. I know. Listen, it's a great way of letting me know I'm a man of the people. If the people are enjoying something, the people are going to be getting something. And I'd be enjoy if this loading screen would end any moment now. Oh, speak of the devil. Right there. Just had to finish my uh, monologue of sorts. Well, alrighty then. We're over here. This land is my land. This land is your land. Can we build over in the train yard or something? I don't know. I'm not trying to build too far, but not too close. Uh, honestly, I wouldn't mind building somewhere around here because there's actually multiple areas. There's another area there that are uh, workshops. We can actually build over there and get a whole ton of resources as it's defended. So that might be kind of a cool thing to do. But TBH, I, I kind of want to build right here. Right in the middle of this crossroad. Seems like some prime real estate. What are these noises? I wish it'd point me in the direction towards them. So I could be a little bit more ready. But uh, let's go. Hit up B. Let's hit up that C-A-M-P-F-I-R-E. Yes, so when she song. Patrick, song. C-A-M-P-F-I-R-E, good. And oh, how if you just sing along. Uh, you guys are singing along or something, right? I don't know. This thing is not want to be put down, though, which is a little bit of a bummer. We're going to keep walking out of town a little bit. Maybe... Oh, here's that little workshop I was talking about. We're going to keep walking out of town a little bit. Because I... You guys need to understand. We need, we need to put this camp down. And at least do some basic base building somewhere. So we could scrap some things. Stash some things. And it does not appear that the game wants me to build anywhere close to here. How much further does a lad need to wander? I just want to be a base game. Is that so much to ask? Can I build over here? Oh, this would be a dope area to build. There'd be like a two-story, you know? Okay, I'm already out of energy to run. How, how much further do I need to go out of here? I'm like not that close to many things. Come on, game. Cut me a little bit of slack. I know you want to. Let's go back to moving that camp. I don't even think I've ever like put this thing down up until now. So usually it costs caps to move this. And, uh, well, woo! Good morning. Oh, you know I want to live under the bridge. Can I actually put stuff down here? 
This will make my life complete because this could be the basement that could be the top floor. <laughs> All right, let's, uh, oh, sorry about the cop. Uh, let's get to building, boys. We got a stash box to begin with. Well then, let's get to stashing. We'll go ahead, I'll, I'll stash things over here uh, up against, uh, oh, hold on, let's, uh, there we go, beautiful, right up against that wall. Boop, you can go ahead, stash things right there. Marvelous. Uh, why don't we also... We want to build up probably... Not blueprints. Let's go and get some of the essentials down. We want crafting recipes. I don't have the aluminum for any of these. Oh, no. I was really hoping I'd have that. Well, worst case, we could go look for some more aluminum. Or maybe we'll have aluminum in here. Honestly, how do I get out of this exit? Uh, we got a little bit. Oh, here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to put some stuff away. I don't necessarily need all this in my life. <coughs> I will uh, put this away until we're in a more favorable position. And what does putting away involve? Uh, a decent amount of stuff. I'm saving that boxing glove. That is the best boxing glove ever. When we hit level 15, that tambourine is going to be striking some fear. We can't use this thing up until 20, so I'll put that away for now. That one's going to be really nice. We're going to get that around 15 as well. I can just put away the 10 millimeter normal pistol for now. We'll save that because we're at 13. We're going to get there pretty soon. A black... 115 damage? What? What? Oh. Okay. Apparently, we're taking things old timey like and we're going to be doing some real good numbers on people. But let's go continue storing some of these things away. I kind of want to put this... Mm, I kind of want to put that pipe bolt action away. It doesn't really seem too amazing. Uh, does it use... If anything uses the same ammo as it, I'll probably do that. Definitely the pitchfork. Don't need that. Uh, we got a pump action shotgun. That's my god shotgun. This is what I made. And uh, then we're going to have a ton of other shotguns that I was actually saving up. But there we got the really nice hunting rifle we've done. You guys can see we, we've been stockpiling quite a few things here or there. But yeah, we really got some nice shotguns that we got to put away. <laughs> and they take up a lot of weight. So that's going to be very nice to have a lot of this freed up. Uh, question... <coughs> Sorry about the cough. Question is, I kind of want to keep the sledgehammer. I feel like that might be kind of a good melee weapon. And uh, that I also definitely have a lot of apparel we don't necessarily need. We got some things I got to equip. Don't worry, but I'll just start putting these things away. The game's a little laggy right now at the moment, though. I think we're trying to put things away too hard, man. We got to... <coughs> Gotta ease up. Going a little bit too ham here. That chest piece, I'm definitely gonna stick with. I think I'm gonna put that away for now. That one's unfortunately a little broken. Uh, <coughs> nocturnal chest piece, probably not. The right arm, <coughs> different story. And uh, I'll, I'll put the jumpsuit away too. And let's also make sure to store all junk really quickly with that Y button. And we stored it. And all right, let's get out of that super laggy screen. Seriously, man, that was hella laggy, and there's my little, my little hidey hole, I suppose. We'll come back when I got more aluminum, when we can actually deck that thing out, but, uh, there's our camp! <coughs> right in the middle of Charleston, which will be nice, because then we don't need to, I don't know, we don't need to use caps to run over here. Now then, where, oh, where is the fire breathers? That is the people I've been told about in the stories. And, uh, it's not really telling me where. What's the quest telling me to do? I think that's the big old question. Uh, explore the Charleston Fire Department. Oh, the Fire Department. Okay, that should be right over that way. Oh, okay. I didn't realize it was right in Charleston. Yo, there better be something dope going on here, man. Freaking Fire Breathers? That's the name of a division that's doing some cool stuff. If they don't have flamethrowers, especially a flamethrower I myself can pick up, I'm gonna be a little bit salty. I also really got to figure out what's weighing me down so much. It might be ammo or maybe like meds and stuff. At some point, we just got to restart from scratch, stash everything we can, and try not to walk out the bajillion things. But in classic Fallout fashion, a lot easier said than done. Like I'm saying, I'm a serial hoarder. I love cereal. I'm not a serial killer, but God dang it, a serial hoarder. That is me. I could even, like, I kind of want to put away that rifle. That one takes up a couple pounds. We don't really use it too much. Ah, dude, actually, it's really nice. It's, like, one of our only full-auto weapons, so we get, like, a real assault rifle. Bolt-action pistol. Yeah, I'll just, I'll just stay with the zealot pipe. There's probably a lot of scorched. Up in here. Up in here. Y'all go make me act a fool. 
Where is fire department at? Oh, hello. Priority responder message incoming. Immediate evacuation of the first fringe church in Charleston is required due to swarming vermin. Blowing in this area does reveal salvage. Well equipped trained personnel can recover. Civilians should remain clear while the bell rings. Hmm. Uh, I'll, I'll visit y'all sometime next time. I also got a little bit sidetracked. This is the way you're supposed to be going. I'll visit y'all sometime. Don't worry about that. Also, apparently there is some sort of a bunker over this way. You guys see that on the little mini map at the bottom? Look, right around 203. Appears there's some sort of a bunker. Oh, oh, oh. That could be interesting to watch unfold. Okay, can I not get up this freaking hill? This town is weirdly engineered. God dang it. I'm too used to my flat home city of Chicago. It's a flat grid. Very hard to get lost. Who's shooting at me? Oh, Scorch Wanderer, you want some of this? No, you don't. Your face ain't prepared for my pipe. And I'm out here. I'm laying it. I'm laying that pipe good. Alrighty then. Let's make our way up this, which is what I was trying to do this entire time. Probably just should have taken this road up. That probably would have been a lot more convenient. Oh, game, you good? You good, bro? All right, it's good. Woo! What is that? It's as bright as can be. Jesus. Oh, it's a fire. Hey, you lit this thing on fire. What delinquent did this? Don't make me call your scorched parents or beat them to death with a pipe. I'm cool with either. All right, I'm unhinged. Actually, no, I'm just trying to survive. Let's be honest. Some scorched parents, they'd probably be pretty salty, man. They would not be happy with my actions. I'm trying to call me being an unscorched... <coughs> All right, here's the fire department. Do I need to steal this ladder? What? Are you serious? Oh, no, we got to get into it. I was about to be like, really, game? Got to steal that stepping stool? I suppose so. Dude, really, this bunker up here. Hold on, I kind of want to explore this bunker. Not explore it. At least activate it. I wish we slid our marsupial mutation, man. That thing made life easy peasy. We could jump over everything. And a half. Come on now, give me something good here, game. Also, I should probably eat some food, get that HP back up. Uh, oh, super mutants. Hello, super mutants. How y'all doing? Don't mind me. Is that what we discovered? The rusty pick? No way. That's probably that area over there. Yeah. I'm trying to discover this area over here. Ooh. A mighty fancy area. The air purifier site. Oh, <gasps> is this what I think it is? Oh, power corresponds there. That has already been taken by someone else. Still though, air purifier site. Interesting. I thought there might be some kind of a bunker, but noted. We got a vertibot flying up in a boot up there. Don't know what that shindig's about, but they up to something. They scheming. They scheming something up. I see you. I see you, fam. You know what else I should try to do? Not only, oh. You know what might be good for getting aluminum? Getting one of those workshops set up. They usually have a lot of resources to collect. Hello, Protectrons. Oh, <gasps> friendlies. Oh, good stuff. Oh, and the log. Gas mask, yes. This is good. Oh, no. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I didn't mean to do that either. There's so many things. What is in this paper bag? Everything. What? Did someone die here? I think someone died here. I am bamboozled. A prize certificate? $100,000. I don't know what's happening. I'll play the overseer after this too, don't worry guys. Uh, so that was telling us how to battle the Scorched over there. 
Interesting. So are we about to train to become a fire breather? <gasps> I'm cool with becoming a fire breather, fam. Oh, actually, before we do this, let's go ahead and get that audio book playing. This video is not sponsored by Kindle or whatever. What, what's that thing? What, Audible? Is that what it's called? They like used to, dude, I remember there was a period a couple years ago. That thing was sponsored like every video ever. I'd be watching the most random video then near the end. This video has been sponsored by Audible. And it's like, Jesus, everyone's out here with them Audible books. Audible books, whatever you want to call them. Alrighty, though. Uh, why don't we head over to the, is it the Hollows? Uh, we want to do the firehouse. There we go. Charleston Fire Department. Automation used to define life in West Virginia. Now it's the only thing left. These training programs that the responders have set up. How many survivors were running through these? It takes a certain calling to voluntarily run into the middle of a fire. Rescue people. Looks like they kept up that spirit. Even as the dangers changed. They must have fought the Scorched up close more than anyone. I need to find out what they knew. Okay, so this is trying to quiz us on like some pretty basic stuff here. Uh, while exploring a collapsed mine, your team leader flashes their safety light quickly three times. What does this mean? Uh, I don't know, dude. I don't think we're going to get all of these passed. One of your squad mates has caught a case of sludge lung. Which of the following sets of ingredients when cooked together can be used as a cure? Dirty water, fire cap, snap tails, scotch cigars and steaks. Dude, it's the scotch cigars and steaks. It's got to be. Come on. You stumbled upon a band of scorched disease people. A brandishing clubs. Which of the following is the only acceptable method of engaging them? Charge in and disable them with police batons. Fall back and engage from a distance with firearms. Sneak up and silently slit their throats. You've captured a scorched infected man who you recognize as a childhood friend. What do you do? Uh, end his life as mercifully as possible. Uh, process answers. Results processed. How'd I do? Four out of seven correct. God dang it. I, do I need to retake this? Oh my god. Uh, don't Bethesda. Are you serious? I have enough school to worry about. You're telling me I need to study for a test and fall out. <coughs> 76. Are you serious right now? Don't tell me you're serious. Asphyxiation and you. I don't want to read all this. Dealing with water. Uh, can this like... You can't be serial right now, man. I need to take a legitimate test in this game. I'm out here enjoying my weekend away from college. I took some midterms. I had some projects to do. And you're telling me I need to enjoy it by taking quizzes and exams. Bethesda Plus. How could you do this to me? What is this? Mind signaling? I definitely got that one wrong. Uh, Repeating flashes danger? That's probably what it was. Okay, so yeah, danger. We got dip. Um, is it like a cure or something? Like, God dang it, Bobby. <laughs> I don't want to search for study materials. This is the worst trade deal in the history of trade deals of all time. Although I don't mind looting up some of this loot, but I thought I have to like do like a trial you know, do something fun to get into the fire breathers. Maybe try to breathe some fire. You know, they'd hand me like a bottle of vodka and a match and I'd be going at it. But no, 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 no. I'm out here freaking studying. Fire breathers first aid guide. I actually need that. Uh, gently bind the burn with clean bandages. So what is that? So purified water, boiled water, fire caps, ash roses. Like, ah, man, this is just... Bethesda, why? Like, is, can I use this as like a cheat sheet in the middle of my test? Or do I actually need to like remember them and then do my test? And ooh, weapons work, man. Exactly what I needed. Ooh, a security gate. Well, don't mind me while I fandangle my way into <coughs> this bad boy right here. Hello, guten tag. How do you do? Ooh, a Vault 76 jumpsuit I have learned to make. A pipe, I have claimed. I was laying plenty of pipe earlier. I got even more pipe to choose from now. <laughs> what is this, a terminal? I can't even hack into that if I wanted to. All right, I've looked around enough. 
It's enough shenanigans for one day. Actually, there's a second floor. Not a, nah, a little bit more shenanigans. Oh my god, there's a third floor too. Well, we'll see. May or may not be more shenanigans. This is the nicest looking stall I've ever seen. <gasps> a button? Oh, it's a shower, that's why. Stimpak? Plus? Oh, nothing in there. Dang it, Bobby. Anything in the door? Ooh. Fancy looking. Ooh, trading post supplies. Good luck with your training, applicant. We'll make a fire breather out of you, kid. Uh, I sure hope so, man. Baton Electrified. This guy's actually got some pretty cool mods over here. Uh, some of which I could afford. Dude, everything's so expensive in this game. Like, really gotta level up our barter or something, because this is, this is whack, Bo. Serrated Blade here. Machete. Single Action Revolver Ivory Grip. Shotgun Shells Stim Packs. Dude, Stim Packs are so expensive. I don't want to buy more. <laughs> Just too much. Uh, can I sell you, uh, this auto pistol? Yeah, I'll sell you that bad boy. Take that. That thing's nice. I'm not trading that. Um, yeah, you can take the mines, too. I'm probably not going to be tossing any mines down. Take a couple of these Molotovs. I don't need so many in my life. Let's sell a couple of these pistols, too, while we're at it. Um, plasma nade. Totally forgot about that. Pump action. I'm leaving that shotgun. Take that rifle. Uh, I like that pistol. Okay, we're good on that. Any apparel? Some of these are worth something, but... Eh. I don't know. We'll see. What's really weighing me down? Ooh, I can sell this bobblehead for endurance. Honestly, I will. It only helps us out for like an hour. That's worth a decent amount right there. I'm probably not going to be doing too many stims either, so I don't mind selling the crazy ones. <laughs> Where's that psycho at? Psycho tats? Go ahead. Take that. I ain't trying to get addicted to no freaking chems out here. It's a rough life to be living, fam. Um, anything else here? Kind of worthwhile. Nah, I think we're good. Miscellaneous stuff, hollow stuff. Uh, nothing there. <coughs> nothing junk. No good mods. Ooh, the forceful stock. My ammo. I can't sell my ammo? Really? I have a bejesus ton of that stuff. Yeah, all right. I guess we're good on that front. Back to studying we go! Oh boy. Ooh, a button. What does this button do? I, I click the button. The button is a lie. Just like the cake. Alright. Woo! Freaking glitched through that apparently. Let's go and take this test. I don't even remember what I just studied, man. My brain cells, they've, they've gone through enough trauma studying for college. This is, uh... We'll see how this goes. If I can't do it this time, I'll just keep trying so we can do this. I don't know why this exists, though. This is just annoying. Uh, light a match. To f That's how you die. Uh, get above the gas and wait or evacuate. Probably evacuate. I, I don't think you want to get above the gas because doesn't gas, like, rise? Yeah, definitely dip out of there. Uh, Water-soaked rag. Probably not plastic wrap or a magazine or paper. What is this? Has been burned. The area is painful. Gently bind the burn with clean bandages. Pretty sure that's what we do. Uh, retreat immediately. I think that's what we want to do. Because he said rapid flashing is danger. So yeah, we probably want to dip out of there. Uh, caught a case of sludge lung. I think it's the pure. Yeah, it's this one with the purified water. Uh, I, I don't remember what you want to do here. You stumbled upon a band of scorched disease people banishing clubs. Probably fall back because you want to stay away from them so we don't get a disease. And uh, bring him back to the station. End his life as mercifully as possible. Please. Seven out of seven. Woo! You are looking at the brand newest of fire breathers. It's a ever oh, there's a physical exam too. Oh, Jesus. Okie dokie. We'll see how this physical goes. Woo! Let's not spend too much hype already. Um, where do I do this physical? Oh, the frick! Oh, wait, why am I going to the Charleston Herald to do a physical? What? I am bamboozled, to say the least. The boy, that's it with that done. That's going to start wrapping up for me for... Ooh, Overseer's Cash. Uh, that's going to start wrapping up for me for now for this episode of Fallout 76. No worries, though. We are returning with that daily content. Hopefully, I could get... 
enough videos out for y'all because today is actually this is november 4th the damn recording that's the last day of the beta before the game comes out in full on november 14th so uh, we're gonna be continuing playing through when that does come so make sure you guys are staying tuned for that as so i follow 76 adventure has a ton of stuff to go a ton of adventure to go and a ton of fun it's to be had but with that said with that done that's gonna wrap it up for me for now thank you guys a whole ton for watching hope this was an awesome one and i'll talk to you next one see ya